Hello, I'm Bradley and welcome to my channel. First things first, if you're new here, please subscribe. You don't have to, of course, but it would really help me out and where I'm trying to get my channel to be. Today, we are going to be talking about a product from Hub Lessons, and this is a leave-in mask treatment, or you can use this as a conditioner. Now, why would I want to be talking about this product? Well, I'll tell you, I've got longer length hair to my shoulders. I've got bleached ends and I've got some colour running through the lengths, but I've got about three or four inches of natural hair regrowth. So my hair is naturally quite fine, but I've got rather a lot of it. Now, I am always on the lookout for products which look after my hair in terms of nourishment, in terms of kind of reverse the damaged effect of what we do to our hair through, whether that be through heat styling, whether that be through product use, whether that be through chemical change such as bleaching. So today I really want to talk to you about this product here. So if you're interested in this, then please do keep listening. Okay, so First impressions on this one. So price wise, this is five pounds. Now, if you shop around a little bit now, you can get this for around that price. It does go up higher. It does go a little bit more than that. But you know what, in terms of, now this is quite big. So this is 450 mil. Usually sort of mask treatments are about 300 mil and sometimes a little bit smaller. This really does last. I've had this for about seven weeks now, I have to admit. Now I don't use it every day because you don't need to use it every day. So this is a Herb Essence Bio Renewal. So it's Essences of Life Repair and Renewal Intensive Mask with Argan Oil. So what I also like on here, it's got the Royal Botanical Gardens Q, sort of, sort of, um, association on the front here so you know that straight away you're going to get something great in this product here which i really like and with herbal essences you know that you're going to get that real kind of quality of product in here as well very often herbal essence shampoos and conditioners um i don't necessarily tend to use them very often not because i don't like them simply because i find a lot of them can be a little bit heavy on my hair um, so I don't necessarily kind of want that sometimes if I'm looking for a bit of a damage renewal type product um, Then this I absolutely love so I would straight away recommend this to you if that's what you're waiting to hear The one I do like from the Herbal Essences range and I think I have reviewed that but some quite some time ago Was the volume shampoo conditioner and that really I do like um, And I think the only thing what I would say about Herbal Essences is, is it seems to say that my hair gets quite used to um, Herb Essence sort of shampoo and conditioner quite quickly. Whether or not that's just a personal thing, somebody else might find that, I don't know. But after some time, your hair can get used to uh, shampoos and conditioners, and, you, and I find I don't have the same effect. But anyway, getting back to this product, I do like the brand, I can assure you. So this stuff here, why would you want to use this? So if you're somebody who is sat there, man or woman, and you're sat there and you use a lot of heat on your hair, or if you style your hair, whether that be through straightening or whether that be through curling whether you're a man sat there watching this and of course you do those things too or if you use like strong hair sprays uh free sprays perhaps you use a lot of hair gel woman perhaps if you use hair gel um sort of woman styles of course around the edges um or anything like that at all perhaps you've used products which have left your ends a little bit dry don't forget anything to your ear is a year's growth Okay, anything to your shoulder is two. So men's hair, for example, you're not necessarily going to get that much length. My hair is particularly longer for a man, but of course there are much, much longer hair on, uh, there's men out there with much, much longer hair than what I've got, of course, and of course thicker. So if your hair is quite thick, quite unruly, and it's quite sort of almost coarse, but not necessarily dry, this is going to be great for you as well, because it's going to pump that nourishment back into your hair. If you're a lady watching this and you do all those kind of great, amazing, glamorous things with your hair and those amazing blowout looks and curling and all that, then amazing. But of course, what we do to our hair does have a really kind of counterintuitive effect on our hair. So we're making it look nice in one hand, but then of course, tomorrow, you're going to then have to see the damage in your hair. So this is great. So how often would you have to use this? So in my opinion, and I'll show you, I'd used about a third of this, as you can see in the container here. I've used about a third of this, and when you get it, it's full right up to the top. So the smell is absolutely incredible. It's almost like you're on some sort of, like some sort of fruity dessert or something like that at all. It smells incredible. Really, really. F I want to say that it's it's so fruity. It's almost kind of like floral. Now, if anybody has ever smelled argan oil or products containing argan oil, it's almost like a really nice, like. A sweet but almost like a creamy type of sort of smell or notions or notes are uh, rather it sends it it seems to, to sort of bring to mind so from that aspect i love the smell 
it's really rich it's really intense the gel actually itself i'm saying gel because that's what i'm going to move on to say it's actually a really rich cream like formation now this of course after you shampooed your hair now i use any shampoo i want i don't necessarily use a herbal essence this one i haven't got any herbal essence shampoo at the moment um but i do like it it is really really nice um in fact i have actually got one and i've only actually used it twice and it's the purple i think the is it moisture or damaged? I'd have to check. And I've only actually used that twice a while ago. And I've got that in my go-to products actually in our, our family bathroom. And that's something I'm going to be revisiting for the channel next week. Um, so I'm going to use that a couple of times actually. And I'm going to report back on that. But this, you can use it with any shampoo. Um, if you wanted to, you could use some conditioner. Then as a real kind of rich top-up treatment, use this afterwards. But however, you can just use this in place of your normal conditioner. Now, if you are somebody who has got a lot of bleach throughout their hair, perhaps a lot of highlights, perhaps you really enjoy your colour in your hair, you regularly colour your hair, <clears throat> excuse me, this is going to be great for revitalising, kind of trying to almost renew the hair from everything what you've done to it. And you know what? It is great. My only kind of bugbear with this, it is a little bit heavy. And I know this because I've used this, um, I've used this a couple of times where I've then straightened my hair after I've washed it. And then the top of my head just sits a little bit flat. So if you are using it, and I don't necessarily use have to use too much at all because my hair is only fine, it does sit quite heavy after you've washed it off. And I do find that, unfortunately, with Herbal Essences product. The volume one, no. Volume shampoo and conditioner, no. But I do find that conditioners to be quite heavy, um, which is not necessarily a problem. But if you've got finer te textured hair, particularly women with longer, finer hair, if you want that volume in the top of your head or in the crown of your head, um, or your sort of curls, your waves to sort of hold a bit more, then just be a little bit careful of this. But what I would do is just really make sure that you're, you're washing it thoroughly out of your hair. Now, straight away, if you can kind of imagine, if you've got sort of, if you had sort of like a diagram with two straight lines and that's your hair cuticle, and then if it's damaged or if you've done a lot of heat or colouring, then the surface gets a bit jagged. It's almost like this type of product completely seals and smooths the hair. So therefore, it's going to sit a little bit heavier. Of course, it's got those rich ingredients in there, which we'll go into in just a moment. But what it does do is it kind of turns the tongue back on your damaged hair. So from that aspect, I really, really like it. The smell is absolutely incredible and it is a really great product. Now, let's tell you a little bit about it, what it says on here. So the secrets of essences of life formula, enriched with precious essences of aloe, which we know is really great for our skin. It's all it's really great for purifying, of course, as well, boosting moisture, moisturizing, all of those great benefits. We've got sea kelp. Now, sea kelp, believe it or not, is said to actually improve the actual uh the scalp environment for hair growth. Now, of course, that's not what this product is sold for, but of course, something potentially to think about. Sea kelp is really, really great for the hair. It's revitalizing. It's really, really great at boosting that nourishment, that health, uh, that sort of healthy kind of environment for the optimum hair growth. Um, and of course, you're getting that nourishment. So if you've got a dry scalp, really, really great. Does this affect my scalp or make it itchy or uncomfortable or sore? No, it doesn't, not at all. And I get quite a sensitive nape of my neck. So this does not affect that at all. So of course, everybody is different, so just have a little bit of caution with that. But for me, no problem at all from that aspect. Of course, somebody else may, so just approach that with caution. But sea kelp, a whole host of benefits for sea kelp in there. So really, really great. And the nourishment is said from sea kelp, just in any type of product, has so many added benefits. So in here, really, really great. Argan oil. Argan oil is known, of course, for that revitalization, that sort of boost, the dry hair, that sheen, that shine. This does give a really nice shine and a sheen, but it does make the hair a little bit flatter, unfortunately. Um, but of course, you can give and take a little bit. So plant based nutrients. OK, it deeply penetrates to repair damaged hair to, uh, to smoothness and reveal its natural beauty. Hair is softer and smoother. It absolutely is. It's really, really soft. I've got bleached ends of my hair, which I always quite surprised with bleach because, it, yes, no matter what you do, it changes the texture. No matter what conditioner, no matter what oil you use, it is still a little bit dry. It is still a little bit coarse. Sadly, the best thing is regular cuts and products like this. Now, of course, if you were just using this once a week or once to every 10 days, great. You're going to keep on top of that. This stuff does ultimately make it much more softer, much more kind of like natural hair. Because, of course, we all know if you're not naturally blonde, whether you're a man or a woman, it's it does get a little bit straw like no getting away from it i'm afraid that is how blonde hair is somebody can shoot me down from there but i really do think that if you're not naturally blonde sometimes i think our expectation of that we can just change our hair color and you can be that natural soft 
sleek blonde is really difficult to achieve. Of course, you can be any colour you want, but I always think, what's the point of being any colour you want if it's dry and the hair's just absolutely obliterated? It has to be in good condition for that shine, that nourishment, that healthy looking hair. So that's ultimately what I feel from that. And I think this would be a really great product to help you get to that, to help you achieve that as well. Let's move on. Okay, so what I like about this, it's a vegan formula. It's a proud partner of uh, cruelty free and vegan. Um, and of course, it's a recyclable jar, which we would expect. And I love that because if any product says that on here now, of course, it's a it's a company or a product or a brand being responsible and it helps us as consumers be responsible because at the end of the day like i always say i want my children's children 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 to enjoy this incredible world we call home and our planet okay so how to use as a conditioner to instantly smooth detangle without weighing down yes it does detangle hair okay with bleached ends anybody will know your hair tangles so it really does do that i don't use it as a conditioner okay i leave it in a product like this you leave it in it says here um rinse out mask apply on wet hair leave for three minutes and rinse to deeply nourish i'll be very honest don't go through three minutes at all. You need to leave it on for about five, six, and seven minutes. So after you've washed your hair, put it in your hair, go on and do whatever you're doing, then wash it out. Then you'll have much more of a better result. Um, and then we've just got a list of all the ingredients in here. So I'll just pick this up because it says on the top here, natural origin, okay, 94%. Okay, so let's pick them up on that. So 94% natural origin, so it's 80% purified water and 14% naturally derived ingredients. The other six, for a good usage of experience and product stability. Okay, so naturally derived ingredients maintain 50% of their natural origin material. Okay, vegan formula, no animal derived ingredients or byproducts. Use of key trademarks and license of the Q Enterprises Limited. Okay, so really, really great. And you know, ultimately, the only thing I would say is just a little bit heavy on the hair, but ultimately, it's great. And how many, were, how many times have I said ultimately? It is a really, really good product and it does give you that real boost of nourishment and moisture. So I really, really hope you've enjoyed this. I really recommend this. Shop around. I bought this one, I think, on Amazon, £5. So it does get a little bit more expensive on the high street here in the UK or wherever you are looking at buying this, but it is a really great product. And I have another herbal essence product coming up and it's the it's the purple shampoo and conditioner packaging. So I can't quite remember what that one is right now. I've used it a little while ago. I'm going to jump back into that and then review it again next week. Um, I think it's damage. It's something to do with moisture anyway around those lines because I'm always trying to look at products and review products. But yes, fine hair and helping you achieve the most and that really great scalp environment to keep growing the thickest head of hair but of course when we style our hair we need to keep on top of the damage in that kind of moisture levels in our hair as well because at the end of the day dry hair doesn't look good on anyone um but however thin fine thinning hair thick curly frizzy whatever on men and women incredible really really cool for a man that even the thinnest of hair can and then even on a woman even the thinnest of hair can be absolutely stunningly beautiful there we go okay so i really hope you've enjoyed this uh clip I absolutely love this product. I really recommend you to try this one. If you do have any questions at all for me, please leave them down below and I will come back to you. And on that note, thank you very much. It's great that you're here. Thank you so much for all your support and all of my subscribers from the bottom of my heart. Thank you very, very much. And until next time, I hope you can join me then and I'll be seeing you then. Bye for now.